gol, 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 golazo, golazo. Barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. We are in the port city of Porto and this unmistakably the Estadio do Dragao. Blue, certainly the colour. Looking forward to seeing this. A capacity crowd here. Well, get ready for some high grade football. Strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. Have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As the weather, we'll see. High scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. So it's down to business here. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Jorginho. The kind of player that can pass a team to death. At first, a lot of his passes seem a little safe and conservative, but they all serve a, a bigger purpose, slowly shifting the opposition from side to side. He's gone for it! It's anyone's ball! Trying to get there. Oh no, that's not the ball he wanted. And it's Ake. Has a pop! He's got away with one there. Jorginho. He spotted the run and played him through. Oh, looks like he's been taken out there. And he heaves it forward. Neither side yet able to find the net. De Bruyne, Foden, Grealish, looks to dink one in, defending of the desperate variety. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really, to be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. Looking for space out wide, cuts it out, gets it upfield. And it's been taken straight back. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. And here's the chance to counter. It was a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Ruben Diaz. Rice. 
Jorginho. Oh, well played, he saw that coming. He's come loose. And that'll be the final action of the first half. So both sides have drawn place. Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. Well, after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. Big chance! Grealish! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. Grealish did give it a fair old crack and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Tries to get it forward quickly. De Bruyne and it's De Bruyne De Bruyne gets it out to the wing De Bruyne unable to make it happen for all his good intentions forward it goes Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Well, he's the quarterback equivalent, so I'm not surprised that he's being closed down first. Shot a goal! Oh, taken with style! The breakthrough arrives at last! And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. The goal scorer, after 64 minutes, is number nine. Arsenal have turned to their bench. A substitution. Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering and listen, we all expect that. Partey pings it in. And that has been cleared. Just brushed off the ball there. Arsenal are definitely going about this the right way. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Grealish with a delicate ball. There really wasn't very much in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Kyle Walker. De Bruyne hoists it forward referee has just said play on and he's got the ball glued to his feet and that's clear cut it's a free kick and it's Jorginho Arsenal need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Ake. And helps available out wide. 
Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. De Bruyne and the weighted pass. And out to safety. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny. Just a goal in it. But that was enough. Yeah, it was never a match that was going to blow us all the way, Peter. But I felt the team did a lot right, especially that well-timed goal.